All right, hello everyone. This is Bingo, and I gave you the sheet music in um, this Google Classroomers assignment. Uh, there's one chord in here that I don't particularly care for, and so we're gonna use our listening um, skills and our chord structure knowledge to see if we can figure out what we can do differently to make it sound better. So here's the original. So in this, you notice above the melody line that there are little letters written in. So those are the names of chords. So the first one is a G major chord, and then a C major chord, and then a D7 chord, and then back to the G chord. Do you hear how that D7 chord, that leads you back. It has a leading tone, so it leads you back to the resolution of a G major chord. It doesn't matter if you're playing bass drum, third clarinet, lead trumpet, doesn't matter. If you can hear these chord changes and the leading tones and the resolutions and start to pick up on a larger sense of what's going on in the band, it's going to make you a better musician. So if I, uh, on a piano basis, if I didn't really care for the left hand or it was too tricky for me and I just wanted to play bingo, um, I could just play the note names that are written there. for <laughs> 